Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Wolfenstein 3D! And when last we left off, Blazkowicz here was in a completely optional level, effectively. We're an optional level because we don't need to be here. This level pretty much is all hidden behind a secret door. And if you don't go into that secret door, you don't see the level. Which is actually quite, quite clever. So, now that we've sorted out all of these saves, let us now move on and basically try not to die where I died at the end of the last video. Because this place is tricky. And entirely optional. And full of enemies that are just going to shoot me in the face. Evidently, there are enemies that are just going to shoot me in the face. Okay, let's be a little more careful. Let's go this way this time. Hello! You're an enemy that was just going to shoot me in the face. Are there more enemies like you here? There's food. I like food. There's no secrets, though, either. And we know that in here there is just an enemy that's going to shoot us. It's also going to be alerted by me shooting. Was there only one? Was there a secret in here as well? No, just treasure. Fair enough. What's in here? Nothing? No enemies? There would appear to be absolutely no enemies here. There are no enemies in here. There is a secret though, that one was a little obvious. Ooh, this is basically an extra life. We're going to be saving that because it also fully heals you. So if we end up on really, really low health, we're going to be using that. And I believe, as I recall, in here, there are a lot of enemies, so we're going to need to be very careful. There we go. Just got to split our fire. There we go. This time, this went a lot better. A lot better. Marvellous. Okay. Let's, uh, have a look around, shall we? In here, what was this room? I do remember this room. Had two enemies in it. And I don't think I had much else in it. Let's move on. Ah, yes, it had this room. We can actually just, uh, fire more, um, less conservatively now that we know that extra life is there. We also know there's a lot of ammunition lying around in general, so, uh... Here's a chain gun! Which we're going to grab for the ammunition, primarily. Excellent. Do we ever go back for that other chain gun? I don't remember. I do not remember. But we've explored here. Pretty much this area is... There's not going to be any other... I don't think you think there's going to be any other keys, to be honest. Now, what was around this corner? Was it death? It might be death. No, it just sort of looped around on itself. Did it? Did it? No, it did not! No, it did not! Those actually were not enemies I'd killed. I'm actually out of ammunition. You see how I ran out of ammo there? There are two extra lives here. We're gonna grab one of them. They also provide you with a lot of bullets. There are a lot of extra lives. We're actually going to grab another one just for more bullets. There we go! That is what extra lives do. They fully heal you and they also give you a fair amount of bullets. Does this area, does this whole section have nothing but lives, ammo and treasure? And health? Most likely is the answer. Because after all, this is all completely optional. We didn't have to go into any of these areas. We also went in here, so we've done that. We've gone through there. So if we back it up... We back up... I think we've actually done pretty much the whole area now. I think we have now... Ooh, there is this door, though. Ah, we've been through here. In fact, I think we can pretty safely say we have been everywhere now. So now we actually have, I think, pretty exhaustively explored this whole level. Which is good, because I didn't want to... really didn't want to leave it unexplored. 
So in here was some ammo, which we'll grab. I mean, we are effectively leaving without full ammo. We could just leave with full ammunition. We could leave with full ammunition, but we aren't at the moment. I suppose nine bullets isn't going to hurt. So in here is the exit, and this time we're going to get a much better score. Much better. Oh, 8% treasure off. Nearly got everything. Nearly got everything. So, now we're actually on, um, we're actually now on this level. Let's now actually save here, because we're actually here now. And now that we've actually properly explored the previous level, let's move on. Ah, you wouldn't even think to look backwards, would you, at this point? Okay, this is a massive plus sign. Let's have a look. There was one direction in every way. There we go. Anyone else? Oh, uh oh! The answer is yes. Oh, the answer is death. The answer is death. Let's be more careful. Let's just go into this door, shall we? Hello. Oh, there's a lot of enemies in here. There are a lot of enemies. I just got shot by one of them. Let's just start getting them, shall we? They're all around here. There we go. And there's a few over here. There'll be health for us to pick up. And then this was the level where there was no health. It was the Hocus Pocus level of Wolfenstein 3D. And then it was sad. Okay, what about round here? There are a lot of barrels that are hiding some bullets. Not any health, but some bullets. And now I'm starting to worry that there in fact won't be any health in this area. Can't go in there. Can go in here. Hello. Was there just you? I do not believe that there was just you. No, there was just you. You were just guarding all of these bullets. At least you were facing the right way. I've got to give you that. Okay, we're going to go this way, I think. Oh, wow, a lot of enemies. I wonder if they're all just going to come from this corridor, or if... Oh, come on. There we go. Or if some of them are going to come from these doors. I think they're all just going to come from this corridor. Hmm, not there. Here? Oh, wow, there are a lot of doors here. There are a lot of doors! Let's start exploring here. Hello? Oh. Health! Hey, I was wrong. This isn't the level where there's no health. Good! That was hidden behind some barrels. You actually have to go in there and look. Health? Well... Oh, my! There is health, but there is also a lot of enemies! Gonna get those bullets. Those bullets. And save. Hello? There you go. Gotta make sure none of these really hit me. That's not all of them. There's one more. There may be no more now. Hey, this place has just got loads of treasure, health, and bullets! Perfect. We need both of those. No secrets, though. We'll be back here if we need more health. And looking at how many doors there are here, well, basically, I think he's... There are a lot of tables here. There are a lot of tables. And he was patrolling. Okay, round this corner. Nope, no enemies. So that was every door. Yep, that was all three of them. That's not as dangerous as I thought it might be. What about here? Hmm. Okay, there's definitely going to be an enemy in here. Nope, no enemy. Hmm. Okay, what about this one? No. No enemies? Oh, okay, no enemies. So there was one enemy in all six of those doors. And there's just health here. Okay, I'll I'll gladly take an area that's not full of enemies and death. 
and actually full of health pickups and ammunition. Remember this is here, Kiko. Remember all of this stuff is here. You are not going to remember that this stuff is here at all, are you? No, nope, most likely not. What about down here? There was a door down... There was not a door down here. Hmm. Okay, but it is where this door is. So we're going to head back here, which leads us back into this area. Hmm. No enemies. What about here? Another locked door. Clearly we need to find a key. Or else we're not going to get very far at all. This is the floor before the boss, though. So I'm anticipating this being a big, long floor. Hello? Okay, a door that just leads to more doors. Two doors that lead to three doors. Three doors that lead to four doors? No, oh, three doors that lead to enemies. Now, I think they're all in there. Yes, they are. Oh, ow. And all there was in here was bullets, but we do know that there's a lot of health in the other areas. Okay, th these two doors led this way. Hello! Even more! Careful. Careful. Even more do Oh! Even more doors, but even more health. And we can't go through these doors either, because we don't have the key. Though we're at full health now, which is always good. Oh, there's more of them! Is that the key that we need? That might be the key we need. But ow. Ow, that hurt. In fact, ow, that hurt so badly, we're backtracking. Substantially. Where is all of that backtracking that we can do? Oh, it's over here! This way to more healing, because ow, our face is in pain. Also, it's not this way we want to go. I think it's this way we want to go. To where all that healing was. It wasn't down here. It wasn't there either. There was a lot of bullets in here, as I recall. And then... Where what? Ah, it was down here, wasn't it? All the healing was down here. It wasn't there. It was sort of around this corner. There was healing in here. In the form of this medkit. And I believe there was healing in one of these in the form of a medkit? Hmm, there was more healing. I just need to find it wasn't in here, but it was somewhere around here. Ah, this is when I... Ah, there it is. I was about to say, just tell myself not to forget where all this healing was, and then I immediately forget where all the healing was. Oops. There was no healing in here. Well, there was, but I took it. There is a door here that can be unlocked. What is in here? Enemies. A lot of enemies. Go. Was there anything else apart from enemies? Bullets? Was there anything else apart from bullets? Was there an exit? There was another key. Change gun! Just fire liberally with a change gun! I took a lot of bullets. It was worth it, because I'm not dead. Okay. Just checking to see if there aren't any secrets around here. There aren't. But hey, we got key number two. I get the feeling we might have needed that key. Backtracking here proved to be very useful. Also, there's more bullets here. So that was uh, this area unlocked. What about the other area? There was a door... Was it this way that we couldn't open? No, but I'm heading this way anyway. Enemies? I heard another one. I heard one. Oh! There! There we go. Hmm, could explore- Oh, hello! Ah! I died. 
As you can plainly see, that was a terrible thing to do. Ah, we're here. So this way is a lot of enemies. A lot of enemies. There are more than that. There are in fact loads more than that. Case in point, all those enemies that I just shot. There's also that one. I was about to save there. Fortunately, this place just seems to be full of bullets and ammo. Which is good, because I need those. Okay. So that was pretty much that way. And this way led to this locked door. Ah, this locked door has the exit. So we know where the exit is. It's right here. And I bet there's an enemy in this exit. Aha! There would indeed be an enemy in this exit. But we're not at full health and we're not at full ammo. And if I can uh, help it, I'd like to be at both by the time we go into the boss area. So we've explored that way. We were exploring this way, if memory serves. And this way just has lots of enemies, I think. There we go. Any more? No? Just lots of spears. Well, if I need spears, I'll know where to get them. From here. What about this door? That door, I think, leads back to the room with the spears. So this door leads to a place that won't have spears. It'll just have zombies. There are going to be a lot of those, I think, in the, uh, the final level. There's food. There's actually enough food. Excellent. There's enough food that we've pretty much got all we need now to go to the final level. And you know what? I think we should go to the final level. Because after all, we have everything we need now. Why wait? Why wait? Full health? Full ammunition? We're not going to find anything else in the rest of the level apart from treasure. So, let's go! We nearly got everyone anyway. We didn't get any secrets, but we nearly got everyone. And every single boss floor has this music. Now... This room has absolutely nothing in it that's going to help us. And we're going to save. Because we most certainly want to save here. Oh yes, we want to save. Because, um, this is a tricky fight. This is actually a very, very tricky fight. And I'll just see if I can show it off. Warning! There are a lot of enemies in here, by the way. We can't see them yet, but there are a lot of them. Unlike in the previous one where there were no enemies, I'm pretty sure this one has enemies in it. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. Nope, there are enemies. You see them there? Yep, there are enemies before you actually get to the boss. You need to be very careful in defeating them. As best we can, without losing a lot of health. Which is going to be difficult, considering how dangerous these enemies are. There are a lot of them. There are a lot of them. There are a lot of them. Hmm. There appears to be nothing here, though. Oh! Apart from Dr. Scabs. Dr. Scabs throws... I don't know if they're knives? They're very dangerous, though. And if they hit you, they deal a colossal amount of damage, and if you die, you become a zombie. You have to be very, very, very careful. Very careful. So, when we come back, folks, we will be very careful. Maybe we don't want to actually use the chain gun for this one, because the chain gun... Maybe we do, I don't know, but I'm sure we'll be able to defeat Dr. Scabs without having to resort to the knife. So, I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Later.
Excellent. So that's a uh, unsuccessful video, I think. Okay.